The Marion County prosecutor has a new program aimed at finding stable housing for people with a criminal record. News 8's Kyler Russell has a mom who will be helped by the program. We at the prosecutor's office are kind of in a unique position because each and every single day we encounter too many people in our community whose only involvement with the criminal justice system has to do with lack of housing, meaning the root cause of their involvement is not having access to housing. Too many of those people come from one demographic, single moms just like Whitney Dixon. Whitney is mom to 11-year-old Lamel, who has special needs. Yes, yeah, it's just me and him. They live in Section 8 housing on the east side. They were forced to move there after she she couldn't afford her $1,200 rent on the west side. Now she's paying 600 half of what they wanted me to pay West. But as a mother, we we found ways. We have to, we don't have a choice. We have to find ways and resources. But that 600 can still be a stretch. She said the new program in collaboration with the prosecutor's office and Horizon House would change her life and many moms like hers. The new program is designed to get help to 35 people in need and victim advocates here at the prosecutor's office will help in deciding who is eligible for that help. The advocates will refer eligible people to Horizon House. From there, both the Diversion and housing specialist will then partner with each person or family on an individual basis to get them what they need. Assistance can range from help with utility bills to paying first month's rent. But identify uh, really real housing opportunities because too often times what happens is you know, people sign up for 30 different lists, maybe they lose track of those lists. Uh, and so what this is going to do, it's going to simplify that process and make it more efficient in terms of being able to identify what is a good housing situation for this particular individual for which they qualify. The hope is that providing housing stability will help people from re-entering the criminal justice system, something that happens on a daily basis. I was talking to a woman who was unhoused and she shared with me and said, I don't know how you want me to work on my addiction issues or my mental health issues when I don't know where I'm going to sleep at night. And that was a very fair point. It's all funded by the Elevation Grant Program, recently awarded to Horizon House. Whitney and Lamel know that having housing changes everything, and not just for them. Okay, let me put it this way. Black single mothers. Single mothers. Program leaders say there's no exact timeline on how long people will get that help, but that they'll give resources until people are in a safe and sustainable housing solution. Reporting here in downtown Indianapolis, I'm Kyla Russell for Wish TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.